Um, first thing is that you're going to need a couple of tools. So these are the tools that I'm using. Um, just basic tools that will help you like uh, secure the studs. Sometimes I use this just in case the, um, the leather is a little bit too hard to make holes through. So um, basically I'll, I'll show you guys how I do that with this. And you get your studs. Um, I also have these star ones. As you can see, I'm studying them on the sides right here. And I hope you guys like this video and you guys find this video helpful. And please like, comment, and subscribe to this video. So the first thing that I do is that I begin to make sure that I know where I'm going to stud this jacket and I'm following the same design as the Selena TMA jacket and what I do is that I get my stud and they have like these prongs where you where you could just poke through the leather so this is how I do it I get the jacket and I And I basically just, wherever I want to stud it, I press through it. It's just, and it's kind of hard when you're doing this for the first time, but um, as soon as you start getting used to it, you, you will get the hang of it. And you just push it all the way through. And then what I do is that I turn it over. And you can see it on the other side. Alright, you guys can see this on the other side. And then I use it, I use my own fingers to just bend in, bend inwards, right? So what I do with the prongs is basically I just secure them. I just press hard enough so that it won't become loose. And in order to, for me to close the other one, I just go ahead and without using my fingers, I go ahead and just seal this in. So that's why, that's why I use the, the tool so that it, it could be secure it doesn't even move some parts of the leather are very thick like this part right here on the side of the on the edges of the jacket and what I've done is that I have um, as you can see I already started on these what I do is just like I make a hole based on the length of the prongs so for example I get my stud Let's say that I want to, instead of, instead of pushing through it, I can go ahead and just press on it. And it will make an impression of how, I don't know if you guys can see this, but it makes an impression of where I need to make a hole. And I just use this to make a hole if it's, if it's too hard for me to just press through it. That's just an, another alternative. The only thing that I, I think that you guys need to watch out for is that whenever you're making the hole, make sure it doesn't go all the way to the back. Because the farther down that it goes, the bigger the hole will be. And your studs will be, they'll be too loose. So you have to like make sure that they, you know, you, you only poke through as little as you can up to right here is where I usually do it. Parts of the leather jacket also requires you to do like you know some decorations. So this is my decorations that I'm doing on the side of the leather jacket, and I have these star studs that I'm just putting along the jacket. They're really nice, and these are a little bit smaller. The prongs are smaller than the than the studs that I'm putting over here, but it's the same process. I'm just I just push the push the um I just push the stud through and you could just feel it through the other side put your hand on the other side of the leather jacket and you could feel the prongs on the other side and then again you just turn the jacket over and then if you see that they're not all the way through then you could just go back and then just keep pressing it through until until they go through on the other side of the jacket That's what I do right here. So then, like I did with the other ones, I just, you know, bend them inward. So 
So that's it. And then again, I can I get my tool, and then I just secure them. And see, and now you have the stars. So Nina's jacket didn't have the stars. I just got a little bit creative because I didn't have enough money to buy all of these. So these stars were cheaper on eBay. So I got I found I did I found these as an alternative because I was just losing money. You know, I bought like over two thousand studs and I knew that there wasn't gonna be enough to put them here, so I just bought these star ones. Let's just show you guys the jacket. Here, as you can see, this is the shoulder part. I haven't done the other side. And, I mean, it's coming along great. This is finished with that one yet. But, I mean, this jacket is coming along great. This is the back part of it. Here is the one from the sleeve. So, I'm still not done with this one. But, it's coming along great. And basically those steps I just told you, you just do them all over. You just repeat everything that I just did. And I mean, this takes time. I hope you guys found this video helpful. And please like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope you guys uh, come back and watch another video. Thanks.